So, this here is Silent Bomber for the PlayStation 1. The goal of this quest is to beat the game, and it has been submitted by Harmis. This is the... Uh, is it the second time we play this? I think this is the second time. Yeah, it's the second um, time this game comes around. Oh, Vyakna with the host. So far we've gotten three hours into the game, or like 2.20 here, but that's because I've died several times and lost my progress. We will continue from where we left off here. I don't really remember where I was. Ah, let's just proceed. Oh yeah, 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 we saw the, the big ship fire some kind of choop the whoop laser. Then I think we died somewhere during the next mission. Hornet's defense fleet was destroyed with one blast of the Fermion cannon. Before Hornet comes into Dante's firing range, we had to destroy the main gun's source. Wait, destroy the Fermi generator? You've got to destroy the react Didn't we do this one? Or we we were playing this one and we failed it maybe. Oh yeah yeah that's where we were last time. We were working on this mission but we never completed it last time. Now I remember why. This stage is really dumb. Because for some reason, it's suddenly like there's so many projectiles. You can't really dodge them, some anyhow. Like in earlier stages, it was pretty easy to dodge the bullets. Like you locked on and then you dodged around for a bit. All of a sudden, in this stage, it's like nigh impossible. Look at how much damage I've already taken. Like this, these things start shooting at me far before I can actually see them. How do I get down from here? Has to be an, an elevator somewhere?
God damn what it. the fuck is that? <laughs> you can dream about that penguin, but that ain't happening. Finally. Assume I don't actually own a copy? Uh, why would you say that? How would you... How would you uh, play the game if you didn't own a copy? I don't know. Or is there something about this game I don't know, maybe? Because it is very expensive. Oh, okay. I, uh... Let's just say I, um... I'm using an emulator to play it because I can't capture from an actual hardware. Let's settle at that, shall we? God damn it. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I use them as coasters. Why would this game be so expensive? I mean, it's pretty cool, but it's not that good, is it? Or maybe it's just rare. Derpy's hosting is very much appreciate. Oh God damn it! <laughs> Jesus, this stage is so dumb. What are these enemies? I open that one? I'm going to die so soon. I think I remember now why I never beat this stage. Because it, because it is pretty damn dumb. Is this really the end? Roger that. I'm going back out. Wait, I get time back, and I get to continue from where I died. Alright, so this stage is just a matter of spending enough time on it. It's a pretty dumb setup, if you ask me. Oh wait, I'm on the wrong side. I shoot the target from here? I doubt it. I really do. Ah, I can't reach it. Ah, oh, shit! Oh, <laughs> I made it. God 
damn it. Taking the fight here is just a waste of time, apparently. We'll just go in there, blow it up, and then run away again. Oh, except for that ship sitting on top of the freaking button to get out of here. Which is that detail. God damn it. There we go. Die. Uh, the lift, there's the lift. Oh, fuck. I don't really remember the way back from here. I think it was this way. Yep. If we get to continue from the last sub stage, this is gonna be a piece of cake. It's just, just time consuming. Well, the count from the Swedish elections come in uh, also. I don't know if anyone really like cares about Swedish elections, but I do, so I'm gonna talk about it. Apparently it was like, <laughs> it's pretty funny that was um, somewhat scandalous, that there are absolutely no scandals at all. The, <laughs> the results from the elections were pretty darn boring. The uh, the right-wing party that everyone thought was gonna dominate didn't like dominate at all. And yeah, <laughs> most people were kind of like, oh, "All right, so it's just a normal election result, like most other elections." That's pretty unexpected. But I think it was for the better. Hello there, Frouge. How are you doing? It's the media. Yeah. And it was sort of like the same as, um, was it the French election? Where the, uh, or was the Netherlandian, Netherlandian election? They talked about, um, they, everyone expected some far right dude to win and they didn't. <laughs> Thank you, Nena. Much appreciated. God damn it. Yeah, it's my birthday today. I get older. Thank you. <laughs> Turned 21 a couple of years ago. Yeah. Destruction! How well am I? I turned 31 this year. So I'm in my in my primes. <laughs> Shut up, Rouge. Fuck you. I'll I'll lay you then, Frouge. I'm betting you're like 29 or something like that. 29 year olds, you're all the same. Thinking you're so old and smart. Thinking you got all experienced. 31 in two months. <laughs> ah shit. <laughs>
Oh, damn it. Shit, this stage. Fuck. I haven't done anything special or so for the birthday. My, my wife cooked me one of my favorite dishes. And uh, she gave me a beer when I got home. <laughs> That's about it. Well, to be fairly honest, I don't really... I don't really ask for much more. I'm perfectly happy with that. A gift? Yeah, I got a... I got an iron, ironing board. I really needed an ironing, ironing board. I got it from my mother. Then I got... Uh, I got two books. That I really wanted. I'm, I'm very much for like pen and paper role-playing games. I got two books, um, one of them I had eyed for a long time, and the other one my sister thought, like, you'd, she thought I'd probably like it. I had never heard of it, but it, it looked pretty sweet. The, the introduction I read. Is this the right side? No, it isn't. Well, if you're not gonna fire at me, I'm just gonna kill you. <laughs> Amazon wish lists. But then Amazon is not like Amazon is not really big in Sweden. Like Amazon Prime isn't a thing around here yet. Like having an Amazon wish list is. Not really something people do. I don't even think Prime is available around here. How's that possum? Possible. Ah, uh, it's the commie system, you know. Yeah, that's that's actually a really common problem. Trying to get people to like, all right. So, what do you wish for? Most people are like, oh, hell, I don't know. I got everything I need. <laughs> I don't care. That's like the most common answer you get when you ask someone like, so what do you wish for? Ah, oh, fuck it. I don't know. We do have Prime. What? Really? But do they like deliver stuff within 24 hours and shit? Ah, they don't, do they? I think like the nearest Amazon station is in Germany or something dumb like that. We just get the channel, so none of the other benefits. I guess I would get a free Twitch sub. Or I'd pay the regular price for it, I guess. So. Ebooks and streams and stuff. Oh, okay. I always get the D. What the fuck? <laughs> I wonder how long this game really is in the end.
Erzählen. Oh, this is bad. The Dante is beginning to accelerate towards our planet. He he's going to slam the ship into Hornet. <lacht> That's right. I ordered the Dante to annihilate Hornet. In the beginning, the universe was created. This made a lot of people very angry and has been widely regarded as a bad move. Come, Yuta. Come to the brain room. What's up, Goro? Let's finish this, shall we? Thank you very much, Goro. Thank you. <laughs> oh, fuck. I forgot I'm... God damn it. I was going to... Uh, I was gonna add a uh, follower counter to my overlay, but I forgot. Fuck. Besides, this is my fight. Please, Utah, just make sure you come back in one piece. Roger that. I wanted to add a like follower goal of reaching 500 followers, but I forgot to add it. I bought. <laughs> Destroy Brian. When I said to come to the oh brain room, whatever he's planning, I don't have any choice to destroy Brian. Brain, <laughs> the last objective left to me. Jesus, this is some trippy stuff. Gonna destroy Brian. So glad you could make it, Utah. At this moment, the Dante is slowly closing the distance between itself and Hornet. I think it's the last stage. Okay, I don't really know at all. But it sure does look like it could be the last stage. Its speed is gradually increasing. Eventually, it will pierce the atmosphere like a bullet. What makes this game so strange is that you don't really get a relationship with the characters. At least I don't think so. It never really felt... It never felt like you really got a... A good understanding of them. There were never any like personal conflicts and stuff. It's just this dude that shows up and all of a sudden turns out to be evil. But it was so obvious from the get go that he was going to be the the bad dude. Hey Jay, how you doing? Floor. <laughs> Incandescent heat bearing the mass of a <laughs> continent comes crashing down, accompanied by countless fragments. What a beautiful sight it will be! Like, so we get it that this guy is nuts, and like, we get it that he's from the village we murdered uh, in the intro cutscene. But could you please, like, build up towards it somehow? God damn it. Welcome, Utah. This is the brain room, Dante's core. If you demolish this, the Dante will completely cease functioning. It isn't from that village. Oh. Utah, do you really believe you can do it? Oh. Benoit! Come. It's time for the game. Do enjoy yourself. Then it's even more confusing. Jesus.
Ouch. There's a lot of cool screen effects though for PS PS1 game. It's quite impressive, I must say. Oh, is that a queen? Oh, it's a tower. Is that what they're called? Towers? I think you're playing the wrong type of chess. Damn it. Am I really making any progress? Or am I just... Do I need to like destroy them at the same time maybe? Damn it, it's so hard to aim. Fuck. I got them both. Yeah, okay, I think that's the key. No? Wait for them to stand still to, to mark them. But you need to mark them with a certain amount. God damn it. Yeah. Jesus! Shit! <laughs> Did get them all? One fell swoop! Jesus. Is this really the end? <laughs> I get the feeling this is the last Look boss. That. I'm going back out. It is just too Go. much going on. It's time for the game. Do enjoy yourself. Fuck. <laughs> It's also so I irritating. Sometimes the dive, the dive technique works to dodge bullets, and sometimes it doesn't. And it is pretty damn random. What the fuck's a rook? Already? The spinning laser thingy was the queen. Ah, that makes sense.
<sighs> Shit, it's so fast. How's this face again that I never really understood? I think blowing them up at the same time was the key, but I'm... I'm not really sure if I just needed to beat them a set amount of times. Jesus. Fuck. Character just doesn't move fast enough to dodge these things. Health. God damn it. That's some good rolls. Really? The end? <sighs> Roger that. I'm going back out. Come. It's time for the game. Do enjoy yourself. Frickin' pawns. <laughs> They are mighty annoying, I tell you that much. Turned out pretty good. <sighs> I just this face. <laughs> the movement makes no sense. The units are made up. Maybe that... Is it called a Rook? 
What we call Torn in Swedish? I think that's the Rook. It's not that difficult to dodge, actually, if you just take a few moments. Because it's always going to aim for you. It's gonna bounce three times. The problem is when it comes from far away. That's when it's hard to dodge. God damn it, that was dumb. Always too slow. I guess not being in a hurry works very well here. The <laughs> worst Devil May Carry 3 ripoff. I wonder what was first. What's a ripoff of what, really? Shit, it's these again. They're much faster. And this. Is Where even am I? <laughs> Hey, I got her ones. This fight's fucking impossible. Oh, and now there's pawns as well. Shit, even better. You have to blow up the queen while she's doing her laser attack. It's just so fucking hard to see anything. Is this <laughs> Who's the king the of Kong? <laughs> the end? Roger that. I'm going back out. Yeah, checkmated. Oh, it's time for the game. Oh, fuck Do me. Enjoy yourself. I think the laser thing is probably the last unit. But I think the laser king laser thing is the queen due to the movement. It moves so fast. The king would have moved slowly, wouldn't it?
I got both of them somehow? Huh. The fuck did that happen? What? I didn't get it? Shit. I think the bomb, the the um, the pillars, or the the exploding pillars are the knights. Yeah, I'm pretty certain they are. That shit spawned right on top of me. That was far too close. Yeah, like what makes this fight so freaking annoying is mostly like how the movement works. Oh, that was pretty damn efficient. Art. Like how you sometimes just get stuck somewhere. Well, I don't really know what these bombs do, but uh, they seem pretty efficient, so... They seem to hit in a larger area. I mean, I like that. At least I know what they do. <laughs> the fuck. <laughs> Is this really the end? <sighs> Roger that. I'm going back out. Come. It's time for the game. Do enjoy yourself. Yes, 
every now and again isn't so bad, right, Utah? Like having a having a bad guy that's obsessed with chess, isn't that like so freaking done? Or is it just me? It feels like one of the most done troops ever. It's just me, <laughs> alright. Fuck. I mean, I, I understand that high level chess is incredibly complicated. But it feels like such a stereotype. Like, I, I wonder... Do I deal more damage if I stack up bombs like this? I don't know. The... <laughs> The game over hint said some. Wait, what the fuck? Why are there two of these all of a sudden? I mean, this might actually work. It might deal more damage if you stack up a lot of them on one unit. Yep. I'm going to read the <laughs> the Geekbot quotes. Shit. It is very unfortunate that I don't have more of the chain lightnings. Because I think the chain lightnings. <sighs> Shit! It mainly just like disbands the unit. It doesn't kill them. It just like forces them away like that. Can't really dodge that laser, can you? Oh, you can. It's just really fucking difficult. I think this is the final boss, yeah. Due to how exceedingly shit it is to fight. Nope, so that was not the final unit.
as I thought. Without the king, the game just isn't interesting. Oh, who would have guessed he would frame himself as the king, right? This is Hornet's destiny. What the fuck is actually going on here? Use stacks and lock on wastely. You don't have to inflict heavy damage all at once if your enemy will recover immediately. Roger right. that. I'm going back out. Come. No. Do enjoy yourself. Are you shitting me? Exactly, it's time time to enjoy yourselves. I think this bomb stacking technique is really successful. Just stack a lot of bombs on one unit and blow them up. Seems to deal a lot of damage. If you die to a boss, you do all the faces. But I mean, some. Uh, I guess, but like. Sometimes. There are bosses that had che have checkpoints, alright? In some games. Maybe not in this one, but I mean, I mean, we have seen games like that a few times. It's not completely unheard of. Or you go like full on Ninja Gaiden on people and make them replay the entire level as well.
Ah, that might be two from you. Fuck. Keep getting hit me there. I think I killed the queen faster than I killed the pawns this time around. As I thought, without the king, the game just isn't interesting. No, it's not GG, it's still <sighs> the dumb face left. This is Hornet's destiny. Is this all you've got, little man? Understand you. And they like they suddenly just stick bombs to you out of nowhere. What the fuck? Look at the amount of damage I've dealt. <sighs> and you can't lock onto this boss either. What the fuck? Done end for say damage. Come, it's time for the game. Do enjoy yourself. I just wish I understood what actually dealt damage to him. Like, how do you actually, how are you supposed to battle this guy?
There's the rook. There he is. God damn it. At least I have a pretty good chess phase now. <laughs> As I thought, without the king, the game just isn't interesting. This is Hornet's destiny. Hey, I did damage to him. Did I hit a fake him or something? Alright, so it's when he when he comes alone, that's when you're supposed to like go for him. This face. What? What? I am the only one who can understand you. <laughs> Is this all you've got, little man? What the? Uh, how are you supposed to react to which of his different attacks he's gonna do there? Because he has like a bunch of them. I've heard cocaine does wonders for your reaction times. I am the only one who can understand <sighs> you. It seems like always run left. Can, <laughs> that seems to be able to dodge him. Thank you, Gru. I'm gonna die again. I don't even know if I'm actually dealing damage to him or not.
Two thirds of the way. All right, so we're doing progress. Damn it. No, oh, fuck. You're the only one who has what it takes, my friend. <sighs> that image attack is bullshit. Is this really the end? <laughs> Did coke once and ended up playing Warcraft 3. <laughs> Priorities, I guess. It's like really strange that his his big image attack. The best thing to do is just to run left. Running right doesn't work. Running left works. A little chess every now and again isn't so bad, right, Utah? God damn it. <sighs> oh shit. <sighs> Must be a pretty shitty five group. If you can win one V five I mean I mean sure they must be pretty shitty, but he must be pretty darn good as well. Right. Has to be a bit of both. These special bombs are really good, like get out of jail free cards. If you mess up. They, they help you get out of this shitty situation pretty fast. My chest face this time around sucked really bad. I am taking far too much damage here. What? Fuck my lock left. Hmm. 
Shit. <sighs> ah, fuck. It always starts to fire diagonally. It's a pretty good in, in realization. <laughs> As I thought, without the king, the game just isn't interesting. <sighs> well, if I could do all of this bullshit strat that he does, it would be pretty easy. Fuck. This is Hornet's destiny. The running left doesn't work either. Is this all you've got, <sighs> little man? It's just that image attack. The rest of this is pretty manageable. Fuck me. Is this all you've got, <sighs> oh man? Sorry for the lack of chat attention here, but I'm pretty focused. Fuck. Yeah, this is the last boss. You can tell from its incredibly shitty nigh... <laughs> like it has a few attacks that are just that one. It's just so badly designed. It deals shit tons of, mo of damage, and you have like, <laughs> is this I don't know, the not even half a second to react to it. Roger that. I'm going back out. Come, it's time for the game. Do enjoy yourself. And the amount of hoops you have to jump through to get to fight that face is... Nice. 
Chess every now and again isn't so bad, right, Utah? That is true. It doesn't have game overs. Could have been could have been far worse, I agree. I like the concept of game overs sorta of died with save features, didn't it? I guess there are a few games that sort of like delete your save file when you die too much. Those are very rare. Yeah, I agree. And it was sort of a way to make games longer. Fuck. I just had to like panic out of it. Yet. Well, as long as you keep above fifty percent health for when we kill this thing, it's fine. Because it gives you a 50% health regen. It takes freaking 3 or 4 minutes to beat this first boss phase. It is just too long. <laughs> As I thought, without the king, the game just isn't interesting. This is Hornet's destiny. Ouch. Why can't I lock on all of a sudden? That may be how you dodge it, you just run towards it all the time. Jump at the right time. So far so good, I guess.
I don't even know what hit me there. He like tumbled towards me while my bombs were on top of him. It's time for the game. Do enjoy yourself. This boss, like, almost reminds me of a... Like, it could have been a pretty good uh, nest boss. With all this... all the phases. Hi there, Para. How you doing? Oh. <laughs> Am I enjoying myself? I am more determined now. Like, this fucker's gonna get it. <laughs> so... Gonna get it. <laughs> I'm working on it, I'm working on it. to vote a game out. God damn it. I just wish the aiming, like the lock on on the aim was a bit better. Because it's pretty common that I like sweep past a unit and don't get a lock on it. That was a pretty shitty phase, actually. This is the first time throughout the entire game, I really wish I had skilled the lock-on range. It's that throughout the entire game has been the most useless of power-ups. Right here, it would actually be pretty good. The voting has opened, everyone. Shall we continue to play Silent Bomber? Get your votes in, everyone. Get your votes in. Shit, this boss is so annoying. Uh. Thank you. It's because I hate you because I'm already here. <laughs> this is like, it's a freaking... interesting. Uh, I so wanna do this. This is Hornet's destiny. I'm always going for that the one who goes backwards. 
Because so far, like, running in this direction seems like a pretty solid strat. Because it makes dodging the hologram him much easier. That's why I can keep running towards the screen all the time. Or away from the screen, I mean. Shit! Is this all you've got, little man? <laughs> I mean, no one would be surprised. No one would be surprised, Penguin. Why do I sometimes take damage from that? Thirty seconds left to vote, people. Hurry! Oh. Making some steady progress this time around, it seems like. Right, we voted to continue, I see. It actually makes me pretty happy. I really want to do this. I'm like, I'm feeling it this time. God damn it. This boss has a shit ton of health. <laughs> Did I get him? It's quiet. Like those city ruins. <laughs> Do you remember Utah? A <laughs> final phase incoming. Do you remember that day seven long years ago when you were a young warrior seeing he knew this was gonna... the battlefield for the first time? He knew time. This was, they were gonna talk about this shit. How do you know that? I was there. <laughs> I know because I was there as well, Utah, observing your every move. You see, I was your commanding officer. <gasps> I'm the one who taught you. How to fight. I'm huh. the one who taught you how to survive. And I'm the one who taught you how to kill. I taught you everything. I taught you everything you know. <coughs> <laughs> you. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. I activated the self destruct. <laughs> I played I played Metal Gear Solid once and thought like I'm gonna write a story like this. <laughs> Ah shit, this is not over, right? Survive Utah Your nightmare dies here. Having final words like that is far less cool if no one hears you. If you're like this lying there by yourself and like your nightmare dies gonna... here and there's like no one is ever gonna hear it. You're bawling. Utah hasn't returned yet. Right. Damn it. What's he doing at a time like this? Henri, come in. Utah. 
The Dante self-destruct has been activated. Get out of there, now! What? But what about you? I'll be okay. I can get out on my own. Give your present location. We'll pick you up in the lander. No, there isn't time! <laughs> Utah. <laughs> oh yeah, it's the same name. <laughs> Don't make any decisions that will endanger your crew. Now go! Alright, Utah. But please, just make it back in one <laughs> Also, like, their, their relationship is involved throughout the game. And... Roger. It just, it never got enough time. It just felt... They wanted to fit an RPG story with like twists and turns into an action game and it never really got the... the space and time it needed. So it just feels strange. A lot of the relationships that are being built like on the, during the game. I resigned from the military immediately after the completion of that operation. With the threat of Dante gone, an internal split occurred over right and interest. That kind of military is a disappointment to me. I wonder how the guys are doing. Be well, Omri. Have a good life! <laughs> Bye bye. This is Omri. Stand by for your next mission. Utah. Come in, Utah. Please come in. So weird. <laughs> I really like that, yeah, horse pool. Someone... <laughs> I like someone really wanted to make the next uh, Metal Gear Solid out of this one. Like someone really wanted to do that. <laughs> <sighs> I wonder if we need to see the credits. I doubt it. It's always fun. Or at least a bit... Uh, it's a bit honoring whoever made it. Package coordinator is my job at the porn set. Make sure everyone gets their delivery. So to say. It was a pretty good game, I must say. That last boss was kind of dumb. But... I had enough to really, like, screw over the entire game, I'd say. <laughs> no, Gary. I actually don't know.
But you're right, it does sound like people couldn't really decide on one name, so they went with both. Are there any after credits? Saving game? Sure. I don't know what that does. Maybe there's a new game plus. Wouldn't that be sweet? Oh, well. We beat the game! We beat the game! God damn it, Seth. Suddenly loud. <laughs> As I said before, we can definitely make a mystery turn with some mission out of this one. I think this is a good game. This is a pretty good 3D Bomberman. Bomberman esque adoption. And say the game flows well and has a crap ton. Do you spell ton like that? Ton, ton, no. Oh. Effects going on. There are never any slowdowns. Some of the latter stages are kinda dumb. And enemies can take a bit too much damage. Damage. But it is not dumb enough to drag the game down. I like it. It is a well worth your time kind of action game. I like it. I don't really want to play it again, but I like it. I, I like what it does.